that was really important for me to introduce myself to the Latino community and say, hey, you have somebody here that can help. Well, good evening to you. I'm Mark Mullins. And I'm Amanda Starantino. The new push to build stronger relationships and trust between the Latino community and the Lawrence Police Department. And as you saw, it's all starting with a new crime prevention director just starting her position. Our Nicole Griffin is talking to her tonight about exactly what she hopes to accomplish and why there is a need. As the city of Lawrence continues to grow, so does the Hispanic population living here in this area. There are new businesses opening and more people moving their families here to Lawrence. Well, the focus of the new crime prevention director already starting her work with the Lawrence Police Department is to build relationships and trust with the Hispanic community. Elliot James Sanchez is starting her role as the new crime prevention director with the Lawrence Police Department. Part of my role is to really look at you know, the crime that's going on to build community partnerships and relationships. One area of focus right off the bat is on the Latino community. But I do speak Spanish. Uh, I am of Mexican descent. And of course, you know, I have a passion for serving my, com my own community. She started her work over the weekend, going door to door with police officers and other community members in the Oak Ridge Manor Trailer Park. It's part of a pilot program aimed at building trust. The group handed out bags of food and supplies, including thermometers, even giving kids coats. The effort comes as the police department is seeing an increase in the number of Latino families moving to the area. Here, the mobile home parks where they were pretty much like, you know, 10% Hispanic. Now they're like at 80 to 95% um, Hispanic or Latino. Reverend Domingo Maldondo is the Spanish pastor at the Caring Place. He also is taking part in the pilot program. It was well. Sometimes at the beginning when they see the police, but they don't want to open. But when we speak Spanish, you know, say, hey, it's okay, we have something for you. Building trust and relationships is hoping it leads to more people reporting crime. Sometimes they are afraid. They are afraid with, because they don't know their language sometimes and uh, they think that uh, they're going to be deported or something. But it's, no, it's a, it's, a, it's a good relationship that we started. Meanwhile, Sanchez hopes it's a first step in the right direction. Moving forward, she plans to reach out to other neighborhoods all across the Lawrence area. Nicole Griffin, RTV6. The new crime prevention director works Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. She encourages anyone wanting to reach out to contact her at the police department but says if it's an emergency, always call 911. There are also two other Spanish-speaking officers that work other shifts with Lawrence Police.